Hello, this is a quick look at the SunVision Cyclone Mini Micro PC. This is an Intel Atom Bay Trail quad core PC with 2 gig of RAM, 32 gig of storage space, Wi Fi. It's pretty tiny, it's uh, just less than 10 centimeters. It's got this really nice look to it that's for heat dispersion. You see, it's just less than, so it's about 1 centimeter deep. You get a HDMI extender and this plugs directly into the back of your telly, so the extender is very useful. So it has HDMI straight on it, but if that's not going to fit, and I'll show you that in a second, you can use this extender. So around the side of the mini PC, you've got the power switch, you've got the power in and a USB port. Around the other side, you've got the Wi-Fi antenna, memory card slot, and a micro USB port as well. As mentioned, this design helps with the heat dispersion and this can get quite warm when in use under heavy loads. It comes with a power supply which you just have to clip together and then just plug straight in. So you can see here it just plugs directly into the stick so it's not powered by HDMI. You are going to need this external adapter. Uh, you may also want to include something like this air mouse as well because otherwise you won't be able to control this. This is separate, you'll need to buy this separate but it is a great addition. Now the HDMI extender is a brilliant inclusion because you can see here it, because of the width it doesn't quite fit in either of these slots because I have a memory stick and some other bits. But when you plug in the HDMI extender, it gives you plenty of space. And when you then fire this up, you're presented with Windows 8.1 pre-installed. Windows does a decent job. Windows 8.1 does a decent job on screen. The icons are okay. The desktop mode isn't as easy to use as you might hope uh, because it's, it's all a bit small. But what you have here is a fully working PC. So you can surf the web, you can do... Word, Excel, whatever applications you need to use, you can use these on the go. You might plug this into a projector, maybe use this for presenting. Uh, now, my own interests lie more with streaming and gaming. So the first thing I tried was uh, just a Windows app game. This is a, a free game, Modern Combat. And you can see it, it does work, it does play okay, but you can see there's quite a bit of uh, lag. It's not exactly smooth. It's, it's certainly not as good as maybe a Windows phone. You might play this on a phone, it would be much smoother, but it is playable. Now I'm using this with an Xbox controller connected via a USB dongle, and I've then moved the PC to my amp rather than behind the telly because there's lots of wires, and I found that the power cable would sometimes come a bit loose. Being a PC gamer, obviously you want to try out Steam, and big picture mode looks fantastic on the telly. It's very smooth in use. Uh, again though, the gaming experience based purely on the stick isn't fantastic it it's playable it works but as you can see it's not overly smooth and and i tried a few different games uh, installed on the pc and and they're playable but they're not great however steam is brilliant because it has the stream mode and this was very exciting for me this is the first time i've tried this i'm streaming this from my pc straight to the stick you can see an immediate improvement it looks brilliant it plays as if it was on the pc um, and this stick really comes into its own here so i've i've spent a lot of time trying this stick out playing a load of games that i've not actually tried out before because i've been waiting to use them on the telly and steam streaming really works very well with this stick so i tried out a few basic games to begin with then moved on to some a bit more graphically intense games uh, tomb raider ran absolutely fine and i've not had a problem with any of the games i've been running at all it is a brilliant stick for streaming your steam library from your main pc to your living room for example and, and games do look great there is something about playing them on the telly that is just much better than playing it on a pc screen Although it comes with Windows 8.1 pre-installed, I soon found while using this PC that I got the little notification to say Windows 10 was available. The upgrade process was very painless. You may need to add a memory card if you've filled the PC already with files. Uh, you will need a fair bit of space. But actually the process itself, you could just leave it going. Uh, it takes a while to do, but it's very simple to upgrade. And again, the desktop mode works quite well on Windows 10 on this stick, but where this really comes into its own is when you switch it to tablet mode. And it's much, much better than Windows 8.1 when it's in tablet mode. The, this is just nice big icons. This is brilliant on the telly, especially when you've got something like the Air Mouse. 
and if you do get this stick I would definitely recommend upgrading to Windows 10 sooner rather than later you'll just have a much better experience it's still a full PC you can still install things uninstall things stream things it, it's still all there and in fact with Windows now you do get some free videos so on the telly this works out really well you can do a bit of yoga maybe do a bit of streaming from Netflix you've still got access to the full store it's a brilliant all-round PC its portable size makes this brilliant for if you're traveling and you still want to be able to stream things like Netflix or iPlayer and there's very little to dislike. It's a very affordable full Windows PC that can also act as a Steam streaming stick. I hope you found this short review useful. Thanks for watching.